Welcome to the Learn Academy. Today we will be exploring the Spanish names and the pronunciation for the names of animals or pets that you may have in your home or animals that you may be able to find out in the wild or in the jungle. Now learning Spanish is very important and it is one of the easier languages to grasp. Many start as early as primary school learning this language and they actually find it very fun, intriguing, and interesting. So let's look at los animales, or las mascotas, which means pets. Spanish word for bee is avea. Avea. Avea means bee. Now, there are other words that you could use for other animals as well. So there is Perro, which is dog, which is we commonly use that word, and this is eagle. Aguila is the Spanish word for eagle. Aguila. Aguila means eagle. Now let's look at the Spanish word for spider. The Spanish word for spider is araña. Araña means spider. So another word that we commonly use in Spanish is also gato. Gato means cat. Now let's look at the Spanish word for wasp. Avispa. Avispa means wasp. Avispa. Vispa is commonly used for the word wasp. So in Spanish, avispa means wasp. Then we also have the whale. In Spanish, we say ballena because the double L's are silent and pronounced as Y. So it's ballena. So ballena means whale in Spanish. Let's look at the Spanish word for bison. Bisante means bison in Spanish. So bisante. We have another one that's similar to the bison, which is the buffalo. So in Spanish, when we want to say buffalo, we say buffalo. Buffalo, or we could also say buffala. That is the feminine Spanish word for buffalo. So buffalo and buffala. Now there's also the donkey. Now the Spanish word for the donkey is burro. Burro. So burro means donkey in spanish now this is an easy word to say burro you just need to roll your arms now the spanish word for horse is caballo caballo means horse caballo horse in spanish is caballo and then we also have the spanish word for camel Spanish word for camel is camelo. 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 So camelo means camel in Spanish. Now I love that animal and I would love to take a ride on that animal through the Arabian desert. Camelo. Now you have canario, which is canary, or you could also say canaria which is the feminine version of the word canary in Spanish. So canary is canaria or canario. Now we also have the crab, which is cangreo. Spanish word for crab is cangreo. Cangreo is the Spanish word for crab. Now we also have another very interesting animal from Australia, and this is the kangaroo. Now, in Spanish, kangaroo is kanguro. Kanguro means kangaroo in Spanish. Now, we all know this is a very fascinating animal that's native to Australia. However, in Spanish, it is called kanguro. So, kanguro means kangaroo in Spanish. Now, for snail, now this is known as escargo in France. However, in the Spanish-speaking Isles, is known as caracol. Caracol means a snail. Now, snails are very slow. However, caracol. 
Now the Spanish word for zebra is cibra. The Spanish speaking term for zebra is cebra. Now cebra means zebra. Now the zebra is very common in Africa, of course, running on the African plains and the Sahari or Safari, of course. Now there's also the pig, which is known as cedro. Cedro. Cerdo or cedra. So it's cerdo, cerda. That's pig in Spanish. Now chimpanzee is chimpanzee. Chimpanzee means chimpanzee in Spanish. Chimpanzee. Now these are also animals that are common in Africa. So similar to the zebra, with zebra, there is a chimpanzee. There is also the cervo. Cervo, which means there. Cervo, which means there. So there in Spanish is cervo. Or you could say serva for the yo. For the do. The do is serva. No, there's also the Spanish word for swan. Swan is cisne is the Spanish word for swan. Cisne. Now we also have the cocker, crocodile. The crocodile is cocodrillo. Cocodrillo is the Spanish word for crocodile. So swan is cisne, crocodile is cocodrillo, and another one is coming up. So cocodrillo, the crocodile. Very common as well, elefante. Elefante, there are Indian elephants, and of course, you know that they are African elephants, and based on the shape of their ears, then you can know their difference. However, this is elefante, so the Spanish word for elephant is elefante, and of course, this is the beetle, escarabao, escarabao. No, that is the Spanish word for beetle, escarabao. Escarabajo means beetle in Spanish. Now there is also the scorpion. That's a scorpion. A scorpion. A scorpion means scorpion in Spanish. Spanish word for scorpion is escorpion. A scorpion means scorpion in Spanish. Now there's also foca. Now, foca refers to the seal. So, seal in Spanish is foca. Now, there's also hen. Hen in Spanish is gallina. Gallina means hen in Spanish. So, gallina. Gallina means hen in Spanish. There is also the rooster. The Spanish word for rooster is gallo. Now, gallo means rooster in Spanish. Gallo. Gallo is rooster in Spanish and gallina is the hen. Now, there's also the cat, which we refer to as gato. Gato means cat. Gato. Gato is the Spanish word for cat. Now, there are other animals like perro, which means dog, as well vaca means cow. And there's, let's come, we're coming up to swallow, galondrina. Galondrina means swallow in Spanish. Galondrina. Galondrina means swallow. Galondrina means swallow in Spanish. Spanish. Now there's also the hippopotamus. Now this is hippopotamo. Hippopotamo. Hippopotamo means hippopotamus, hippopotamus or hippo in Spanish. Hippopotamo. Hippopotamo. No, the ant is hormiga. Spanish word for ant is hormiga. Hormiga means ant in Spanish. Hormiga. Hormiga is a Spanish word for ant. Now let's look at another fascinating animal. Irafa. 
Giraffe refers to the giraffe. A giraffe is also a popular animal in Africa. Giraffe. Giraffe means giraffe. There is also leon. Leon refers to the lion, the king of the jungle, also very popular and can be found on the African plains and rocks sitting with their pride. Leon means lion. Now we have the parakeet or what we call the parrot, which is also known as lora or loro in Spanish. So the parrot, also known as the parakeet, is known as lora. Lora means parrot in Spanish. There's also the fly, mosca. Mosca means fly in Spanish. Mosca. Mosca means fly in Spanish. There is also the mosquito. So, a mosquito. Spanish word for mosquito is mosquito. Mosquito. So, fly is mosca. Mosquito is mosquito. And there is also the bear. This animal is very brave. Oso. Oso means bear in Spanish. Oso. So when you want to say bear in Spanish, you say oso. Now there is also the sheep. Ovea. Ovea means sheep in Spanish. Now these animals are famous for their wool and their mutton. Now, ovea. Many persons even like lamb chops. Ovea is Spanish for sheep. Now, this is the partridge, which is perdiz. Perdiz. Perdiz means partridge in Spanish. Perdiz. The Spanish word for partridge is perdiz. Now, we love birds and we love to visit aviaries. Now we're at perro. Perro refers to the dog. So perro means dog in Spanish. Perro. Perro. Now we are at the chick, which is like a baby hen or a baby rooster. Pollo. Pollo means chick in Spanish. Pollo. Pollo. Loco pollo. Crazy chicken. Loco means crazy, pollo means chick. Then we have the penguin. Pinguino. Pinguino. So pinguino means penguin in Spanish. Pinguino. Also pinguina, which is the feminine side of the noun, and pinguino, which is the male penguin. So there's also grasshoppers. Saltamontes. Saltamontes mean grasshoppers. Saltamontes. Saltamontes is the Spanish word for grasshoppers. And now we have the snake. Serpiente. Serpiente means snake in Spanish. Serpiente. Serpiente. And then we are moving towards another king of the jungle, the tiger, tigre, tigre, tigre means tiger in Spanish, tigre. So you have the lion, the tigre, the zebra, the cerdo, cerda, which is the pig, and tigre, which is the tiger, topo. Topo means mole in Spanish. Topo. Topo is the Spanish word for mole. Topo. Topo. Now there is also vaca. Vaca means cow, but currently we are looking at toro. Toro is the bull. El toro. Bull. Toro. The bull. El toro means the bull. And we're coming up to an amazing, legendary 
sea creature called the tortuga which is turtle they have been around for ages and they live forever and ever tortuga now tortuga means turtle tortuga 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 now we have vaca vaca means cow vaca vaca means cow and of course let us recap a few of our favorite animals so there is perro which means dog there's gato which means cat let's look at zorro zorro means fox zorro if you remember the movie zorro zorro means fox there's gato for cat pajero for bird cabal for horse pony for pony vaca for cow raton for mouse mono for monkey chanso a cerdo for pig cerro for deer elefante for elephant girafa for giraffe sabra for goat bui for ox gorilla for gorilla now like comment share and subscribe remember review the video if you want to learn the animals names